Hello everyone, I am TV Raman and this is my office mate. Hi, I'm Charles Chan. And this is Hubble Labrador, the web famous dog. And uh, we are here to plug our session on i3 Android. Um, this work is really focused on using your Google phone in environments where you're either not capable of or unable to or unwilling to look at the screen. I do not believe a smartphone should be used like this. I believe you should be able to use it like this. I want to be one-handed. I want to be able to use it in environments where my eyes are busy. We've been doing a bunch of research work on user interfaces that work for that modality of interaction using the touch screen. Um, you can see some of this on our Eyes Free Android channel on YouTube. A bunch of research has gone into this in terms of what works as far, as far as user interaction is concerned. And you know, over time we've distilled that into a few lines of code that can be called from a library. Um, so the goal of this talk will be to walk you through the thought process that led to some of these UI innovations. Um, show you how they actually work in practice. Right, so we'll go through both the text-to-speech library as well as the gesture UI library that we've developed and open sourced. And we'll then go into a deep dive through a example of a music file browser that lets you browse music files on your SD card. And we will show how in about 10 lines of code you can add full text-to-speech functionality that enables speech feed spoken feedback for browsing and other actions. And then we will show how in a few more lines of code you can easily add gestures to the system and thus create a complete eyes free experience. So we hope you can join us at Google I.O. It should be a lot of fun. We have a lot more good stuff to show you. Won't fit in this two minute margin though, so you'll have to make it there. See you there.